Hello, welcome to my playthrough of Cringe. This is episode 2, map 6, Domination of the Dead. And this is E2M6. As a start, you can take one of two passageways. You should take the right one. Open this wall. This is some weird mid texture stuff. This is our first secret. Out of nine. Out of eight to be more precise, because one of the secrets cannot be obtained. See? It's a one sided wall. I like this gradual lighting change. But what I do not like is this. Come on. And this. This is just awful. But we kind of need all this stuff. This is a slow crusher, it will kill you. What? I have never had a Baron end up here. Uh, what's up with the crushers? Why did they slow down? Okay, I'll skip the armor. Oh no, I fell. And the rockets. We'll be fine. Okay, now we go to the left one. This room has damaging floor. I guess it's something like the evil presence. You know, like uh, the pentagrams hurt you in sigil. I mean, not the pentagrams, but uh, the icons of seen things. Romero was not the first one to make it. Now with the blue key we go back to the starting area. This thing opens up. Technically, it is a secret, but uh, when it lowers, it changes textures and effects, so it stops this being a secret. This is why you can only have 8 secrets in this level. Most of these hallways lead to this same area.
right. Now we can proceed uh, to the left. Sneaky Baron. Oh, Baron out of SLs. That's not good. And now we finally have a computer area map that will help us find all the secrets. There's two in this area. Let's go... no. Let's go there. This is not the exit. If you open this, you get a yellow key. If you hit this, I don't know what happens. This one releases monsters. And this one activates a crusher. Like this. This is a secret. That's a very generous secret. If only it had a BFG. And this is a red door that we cannot open yet. But do not drop down to pick up these items or get the switch. It's a fake switch. As soon as you drop down, a wall raises, rises. And you cannot get out and you die. Now there's a secret here. Just a medikit. I think there's a deathmatch plasma rifle there as well. Now, where do we go? Yes, there's a yellow door here. And this is... this looks good. Let's use a plasma rifle. I think I should go down first. Wait, no. This is not the way. Shouldn't it open something? All right, this was closed off. You can get a chainsaw here, but uh, I don't know why you would.
Let's go up. And from here you can drop down to the starting area. Oh no. Why does it lower behind you? I don't know. Okay, let's enter the teleporter. I hate such teleporting puzzles, but... You have to go back, cross this line there. Oh, no, that was wrong. You should cross this line there. Now we have this red key. Oh no, my ears. Uh, where do you have to go then? Yes, like this. Then jump to this teleporter. And this counts as two secrets. It teleports me back. Alright, time to leave the level. Yes, I think this is the shortest path. Through the blue door, then oh no, I chose the only one, the only two pathways that do not lead anywhere. Lowering the lift also lowers this. And now we have all the secrets. And all the kills. So, that was E2M6. There's only two levels left. See you next time.